Hi, welcome to In the Cool, fishing show for the fish eater. I'm your host, Chris Davis, here in beautiful Titusville, Florida. See, and we can put some fish in the cool. Every time we go fishing, we always bring our ruler. Cause if that fish is big enough, we put him in our cooler. Take it home for lay him up real nice. Invite over some friends for a feast tonight. We in the cooler. I'm the host that brings the most. My wife and I fish Florida from coast to coast. We in the My cooler. kayak boat paddle board on land. We even working on our in the cooler fishing stand. We in the cooler. I'm the host that brings the most. My wife and I fish Florida from coast to coast. My kayak boat paddle board on land. We even working on our in the cooler fishing stand. We, we in the cooler. cooler. It is nice out today. It is really nice. Can't say it enough. I usually wait until the sun comes up to get out here on the water. I think I'm gonna have to stop doing that. Just being out here this time of day where it's kind of cool. Get that bite before it runs out. Also, you get to get out here before all these boats go to ripping up and down, coming through the channel. Heading down to the Holliver Canal or maybe heading south. A lot of traffic comes through here, so I'm kind of thinking this is going to be pretty good to be out here before the traffic does. So, let's see if I can make it happen today, man. Like I said earlier, I've been fishing and fishing and fishing and fishing. Haven't been doing a whole lot of catching. If there was a time I used to show you when I didn't catch fish, but uh, after reading the comments, I figured. I might want to stop doing that. <laughs> People are watching to see fish being caught. But there's a lot that goes into catching fish. There's a lot that we like to show you just because we get to see it. And we're out here all the time. So when you're out here as much as I am, I think it's pretty cool that you bring people some, some stuff that they don't get to see. This is my office. This is my office. It has zero windows and I'm not complaining at all. We'll be right back. More in the corner. in the spot this morning. Railroad bridge. We'll get over here and take a look around. I feel like my position could be right here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take this spot. Hopefully that did. 
All right, before I put my camera on my chest, I got my chest harness on, as you can see. Um, something I'm gonna start doing on the Nicole. I gotta remind my people, if you guys are watching my show, if you guys are liking my channel, I really appreciate that, but I want you to do one thing for me. I want you to make sure that when you go fishing, you follow the rules. And it's very easy to not to follow the rules. You can be off by an inch on um, here or an inch there. So make sure when you go to your bait shop, you always pick up your fishing regulations. This right here, with this really good looking lady on the front, with that really, really nice sheep's head. This book gives you everything that you need to know. It lets you know about the area that you're in, the areas you might want to fish in. It gives you the guidelines. It gives you the sizes. Uh, it helps you to recognize species. It's a good book. Most importantly, it's free. So when you go to your bait shops, it should be on the counter. Grab one of these. Always keep one of these because fishing is a privilege and not a right. And if you get caught breaking the rules, they'll take away your privilege and you'll no longer have the right to put fish in the cooler. Follow the rules. All right, all right, all right, all right. That's gonna do it for this episode of In The Cooler. We got one black drum in the cooler and I'm pretty cool with that. Uh, big fish, 34 inches, a really nice, strong fight. The only problem is we do not have this catch on video, but we have the fish and spider. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out the website at www.inthecooler.tv. That's www.inthecooler.tv. And until next time, Thanks for watching in the cooler.